I am so grateful to welcome each and every one of you here today as we settle into the circle and begin to gift ourselves permission to relax, feeling held in the nurturing embrace of Amatola Care Farm. And our theme today is embracing joyful connection. To guide us, we're welcoming Otter as our spirit animal. Playful and social, she teaches us to celebrate the blessings of community and the importance of balancing work and play. And like the otter glides effortlessly through the water, her spirit reminds us to move with the same ease and joy in our relationships. And we embrace this today, feeling the heartbeat of Mother Earth below us and the whisper of her winds around us. Animals just like the otter teach us the essence of connection and the profound healing that it brings. And so as we shift our focus inwards, preparing our body and soul for a journey into the sanctuary of meditation, aligning with embracing joyful connection, guided by our spirit animal, the otter, as a pathway to aligning our breath and our body into the present moment. And so start by visualizing and feeling the earth below you, Whether you're seated or lying down, connect with that solid presence. Feeling the support of the earth, just as the otter feels the currents of the river. Breathing in deeply, breathe in deeply the life force that's all around you. Imagine that you're filling up your lungs like a balloon And as you exhale, just letting go of any tensions or barriers that stand between you and joyful connection. So with each breath, just let your spirit rise and fall. And I invite you to let your awareness glide through your body just like an otter moves playfully in the water. You can start the crown of your head and work your way down, relaxing your forehead Ease your eyes, soften your jaw. Moving down to your neck and your shoulders, let them just relax and become heavy like willow branches just naturally and gracefully drooping. And as you move further down, releasing any knots that may be in your chest and your stomach, making space for love and healing. Relax your hands, relax your fingers, let them be as fluid as the water that nourishes the otter. Continuing down to your legs and your knees and all the way down to your toes. Just feel them connect with the earth, strong like ancient roots into the ground, anchoring you into this now anchoring you as you feel yourself becoming more and more relaxed, allowing any sounds or movement around you to take you deeper into meditation. And as you surrender and let go, and go deeper and deeper, visualizing your body becoming as light as a feather, so light, that it's able to be carried away by a breeze and the wind whispers that it's taking you to a unique place on earth it's taking you to the serene and the playful habitats of the riverbanks and the marshlands where the otter lives and thrives and as you arrive your feet softly touch the wet mossy ground you realize that you're standing next to a beautiful, flowing river. The sky above you is a canvas of pastel blues and golds. And the air smells of damp earth and fresh foliage. Mother's earth is beating with the rhythm of yours. 
Their heartbeat is grounding you into this moment. This is the world, the magical world of Otter, a place for joyful connections and harmonious balance. And breathe. Just go deeper and deeper and deeper. And out of the corner of your eye, you spot a sleek and playful figure emerging from the rippling water. You see that it's an otter. It has thick fur and twinkling eyes, a living symbol of playfulness and community. She looks at you and in that gaze, you see a mirror to your soul, reflecting the essence of joyful connection. It's as if the otter knows why you've come and she's saying to you, welcome. Welcome, kindred soul. Welcome, friend. Come be here. Come be here with me now. She calls to you to follow and effortlessly dives back into the water. You take a deep breath in and you fill all of your lungs with courage and walk into the water, diving in and as you swim, she leads you towards this small cave, a hidden, serene lagoon surrounded by tall reeds and blooming lilies. The otter circles around you, splashing water playfully and in that gesture, you understand the wisdom it imparts, balance, community and joy. Floating in this secluded lagoon, you feel your body, mind and soul wrapped with the otter's medicine. A sense of calm is filling you and you're learning to embrace these currents. You're realising that with this medicine, you can navigate the rough and the smooth waters. You feel at one with the otter and with her nature and most importantly with yourself. You're reminded of the wisdom of Wayne Dyer that when you change the way you look at things, the things that you look at change. The otter gives you one final affectionate nudge. She whispers for you to carry this newfound wisdom back to your world. You realise it's time for you to leave and so you slowly make your way wading out of the lagoon, feeling the water droplets trickling off you like tiny jewels of insight. Your spirit feels lighter and yet fuller as you make your way back up to the top of the riverbank. You notice the wind is picking up again and you start to float back to where you began taking with you the friendship, the bonds and transformations experienced in this sacred space. And as you float gently along the winds of wisdom, visualizing for yourself how this medicine can be woven through your life, you gently land back wherever you are and you remember that love heals and that together we rise and so taking a deep breath in and gifting yourself a moment to just bask in the profound sense of connection and renewal that you've just experienced you can carry the otter's wisdom with you today as a guiding light on your unique journey to embrace a brighter future for yourself And as you ignite this light within you, you shine it out into the world. You make the world a little brighter, one heart at a time. My name is Katie, Katie Wyatt. I'm the founder of Ancel I Rise Foundation, home to Amatola Care Farm, where we use the magic of animals and their high consciousness to help heal hearts. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you. I'm so grateful that we got to connect in this way. I look forward to meeting you one day in person. Until then, together we rise.